to the right, to the right, to the left. Kids who don't try this at home. Oh yeah. I'm gonna put it in. I'm gonna put it in. Place. Continue straight. I'm gonna show them out the road. Switch. Yeah, you did. You wanted me to be left outside. No, I would never do you like that. 121 is the south. Then make a U turn. What you talking about, sir? Continue on Texas 121 business. Look cool over there. Look cool. What do they mean? That's a good thing. So you got great. I can't even afford a gap. Mm -hmm. We on the same team. We're talking about taking a shot at you. So I'm back in the car. Welcome to Vlogmas episode three. So I'm just running some errands today. I don't really have too much to do. And I'm also going to kind of talk to you guys like what my favorite memories um, from Christmas are and um, they're not going to be recent they're going to be like memory memory so like as far back as I can remember um, just what are some of my favorite memories of Christmas so um, the first one okay so the first memory like one of my favorite ones that I have and I really don't know how old I was um, but I do know that my great-grandma, Nani, um, she was still living at the time. So we had went to go visit her um, in the nursing home. She was in a nursing home. She did have um, Alzheimer's and dementia, I believe. But um, we went to visit her on Christmas. And uh, one of my cousins was playing on the piano. And she started singing um, just one of the songs from her real great. She sang it, knew every word. And it was just a beautiful, like, moment. Because um, her, you know, all time of this set in really bad. So she had her good moments and her bad moments. But I know that will probably be not my number one. Um, the number two. A break. Oh, I don't even want to see that on if I get a ticket. Uh, mind you, I live in Texas and it does not really get cold, cold here um, unless it is like December, January. Um, other than that, it's pretty okay. Um, but you know, 40, 50 is cold to us. So, so um, I think this Christmas it was icing and snowed and it was really bad um, and it knocked out the power. So this was, I think, back in 2000. So I usually go visit my grandparents like every holiday. I lived um, like four hours away from them. And yeah, I'm just driving. I don't know where I'm going. But yeah, so I lived four hours away from them. And I usually go see them every holiday. So know like how long the storm was but I, I think we didn't have power for like two weeks and I probably got like a three week or four week December vacation so my papa I think he had a generator so all the lights are out on the street you know over uh, the town basically and we basically are just living off you know this generator and the power so the first night it wasn't on the first couple nights um, but he had, um, stop, go, um, he had these little, cause he was in the army, so he had these little kerosene lamps that we were carrying around, and, you know, all our family was there from in, in there from out of town, um, we were playing, like, games, we were playing Monopoly, um, we were playing all types of things. And we would go, we would be there at the house and then we would leave there and we would go over Nani's house. This is when she was still at her house. Um, and I don't know, I don't know like if she was sleeping, woke up, when she woke up and she told us to go to bed because we weren't supposed to be up that late. Even though it was Christmas and we were out of school and everything, but 
told me and my cousin Kayla to go to bed. Um, but we were up playing Uno with the adults at the time. And I don't know, it was just that, that whole two weeks. I mean, it, it was bad. You know, we didn't have any power, but we, I remember, I think we had an ice snowball fight or something. Because we know we never get snow, so we, I think we were happy at the time. I don't know, I wasn't driving at the time, so I have no idea if it was snow or ice. But I know we did make snowballs, and then we had a snowball fight with this, uh, with our, night, our neighbor across the street. And we put the snowballs in the freezer because we were like they're gonna they're gonna last longer that way and they're gonna be harder when we hit him because we, we had little bushes we were hiding behind and like literally we had like a snowball fight like it was so funny so my second favorite one so basically it was like Christmas and it was an ice storm and all our power was out so basically we had to you know use the little lamps and go off the generator we were playing board games like you know kind of take you back but um that's number two and then like just like every Christmas uh, from Christmas tradition my aunt uh, she used to take us to this neighborhood where they always see lights every year and they kind of work together in the way that um it said Merry Christmas kind of like a u-shaped um, neighborhood and we used to go over there just see the lights like i love to see christmas lights at christmas and yeah so those are my top three favorite christmas holidays um you know let me know what your favorite christmas ho holiday memory i said christmas holidays those are my favorite christmas memories and just let me know what your favorite Christmas, Christmas memory is in the comments. I don't know why I can't talk today. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. So just let me know what your favorite Christmas holiday memories are. And thank you so much for watching. Today's video it was really, really quick. Um, I don't have too much going on today. I'm just going to run to the post office. Run back home. Eat. See you taking pictures, cause that man has stereo. Mama see me.